I like it, man. I feel like we have. What was the last Espa song we done? Um, I don't know. It's been so long. But um, I see they taking stuff from the Matrix. Yeah, I about to say the Matrix. That was Kill Bill. Yeah, um, I know, right. What else was in there? Was something else in there? Fast and the Furious. I, I feel like that might have been like the whole car flip scene. Oh, really? I mean, I felt. Like I was just was, playing. I just, I just felt like they were just going to keep going, like just different movie scenes. It might have been. I feel like maybe Sin City was in there. It could be. I don't know. I, I, I like I like the word I like the wordplay and the flow of this video. Um I can say that at first it did kinda like I felt like I wasn't gonna like it as much and that was because of one one thing that they I felt like they were gonna do. I thought they were gonna be so repetitive with the drama. And I, my thing is I'm very big on that. I feel like sometimes songs do it too much to where it's like don't do it too much. Mm-hmm. Like like get me into it but don't put like drama in there too much and i and i when i first when the course first broke down i felt like they did it like just a tad bit too much but then as the song went throughout like they stopped it seemed like they stopped doing it for some uh-huh. reason and I, I like that more because it seemed like it was a it's almost like a thing to where the song kind of changes like it changed and it like changed. It leveled out a little bit that too and it just kept changing like it seemed like they did it less and less and that's not to come anything against them i just sometimes i just i'm just very picky about like repetitiveness as far as like i feel like everybody has so much to offer like you don't have to put it like so much in there but i enjoyed the song bro i enjoyed the hardcoreness of it i enjoyed the beat I enjoyed um, just the overall look of the video. Like I mm-hmm. said, the whole Matrix thing and their, their acting skills as far as the blade cutting and stuff like that. I liked it, man. I, f- I feel like for us not hearing them and at least some time, I feel like I definitely liked it for being able to hear something new for them. I'm going to say this song wasn't really more my speed. And I know it's meant more so, um, probably more so like a female aspect mm-hmm. as far as what a female would bring. But I was hoping, I'm like, I hope this ain't something where it's like, like a female wants to bring i was trying to get the correlation between the chorus and actually what the song may mean mm-hmm. um but i just kept feeling like it was just like them saying that they would bring drama but i don't really i don't think that that's it i feel like it's like a deeper meaning to it I no I, I think it was the opposite what i think it was saying like don't bring drama to us but then they kept saying that they were the drama or that they bring it but it was a one part in there too where they were saying they were pushing boundaries and stuff like that too. Like, like we're pushing boundaries, we're uh, doing something else. But it, I, I, I don't know. I Even like, the beginning, I was trying to figure out like what the beginning meant. Like when we had to read the beginning, it's like I, so, it, it could be a whole thing as far as what, because you know these K-pop artists they go through these things where they might have stories and things, and we kind of have to look more into it to actually understand it. So it could be one of those things. I um, kind of thought what they did is something that we did in like a video. I, can, I don't remember which video it was, but we had something till we put like the little synchronized head bobbing type of thing on there. Uh-huh. But we wrote everything that you should do or something like that. Or what's going to happen? But then we said something that this is all fake at the be- at the end. And I feel like we kind of did the same thing in our video. But it, like I can't I can't tell you which video it was that we did it. But it was something like that. And I kind of feel like it just. It was meant to disclude everything that ju- just was said. Like, and I don't know. It could have been like a joking type of a thing. Like, meaning like in the beginning, all the stuff they told you not to do. Yeah, like, don't worry I, about this. Well, thing. I get that. No, I know what they were saying, but I was still trying to correlate at least the chorus with what I feel like they were trying to get their message out about. Like, do they bring the drama? Is drama not necessarily what I think it is? Like, is it something different? Like, is it? Because I I seen that part too. It's like they were pushing boundaries. Like. Mm-hmm um me and you together something um but i felt like i was trying to get that aspect of it but i still felt like just the whole for one the whole acting aspect and the whole music video in itself to just see a lot of stuff that you probably just normally wouldn't see and to also see the different movie scenes i felt like it just it just draws you in automatically so i definitely liked it for the aspect i liked it for the flow the beat was definitely something that is very catchy um the chorus to me i can kind of agree with kogan I don't really like um, just something that is going to be so repetitive. And I did feel like it went down as, and more and more. But I, shout outs to Esper, bro. Shout outs to the people who requested this. Um, I feel like we definitely got to dive more into their whole little... Uh, I just hate mentioning the fact that we so behind. But it just it always feels like within that being behind, it's like you always cannot know something. Mm. Something could always be left out to where it's like, if you were caught up, you'd be like, oh, okay, I get it. But at the same time, you know, it's kind of it's just popping. Yeah, yeah and if you got, and if you guys can elaborate as far as you know anything that we didn't understand, of course, like I said, we're we're new to this type of stuff as far as 
not necessarily new to Espa, like just but just new to like not understanding things that go along with Espa. So uh -huh. if you guys can definitely elaborate on that too. And also too, I do wish there was a part and I feel like the 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 uh the samurai scene or as far as like the Kill Bill looking scene, I feel like they did it twice. Like it was like the same thing twice. Yeah, I think they, they cut the like they, they cut the person but the words also showed up on the whatever the blood came out on. Yeah, but I feel like they did that scene twice yeah, though. Like I know. I just wish they would have did a different scene. Like a different uh -huh. I wanted to see her do more cutting type action like with uh -huh. the blade or something like that. But you know, I'm, I'm going to shut myself up cuz I'm not the one making these videos. I'm just the one reacting and watching. I just, but I I can respect and and acknowledge that they they did a wonderful job as far as the beat and just choreo and stuff like that. So Yeah, same here. Even okay. like when they were doing like fast-paced movements, like it would go to one person like doing like the uh their lyrics and like uh doing like their um their verse and then it would go back to like some sort of like fast paced movement as far as like everybody else around them. And I thought yeah, that was just dope. think about and I don't want to take too much time because I know we gotta go, but just think about the level of professionalism that you have to be at in order to do stuff like that. Yeah. Like to to just be on it's like you can look at an artist and see, hear them rap and sing, but to, for them to go into a whole fighting scene and doing moves and stuff, it's like all right, that's mm -hmm. like it's taken away from what you have to do as an artist and now putting yourself in a whole different light for somebody or a fan to see you. And I just felt like you gotta give that respect, bro. You gotta clap it up, so. Yeah, definitely. But guys, with that being said, guys, make sure you send us some more Esper. We definitely gonna check out some more, but guys, with that being said, we're gonna go ahead and get out of here. Once again, my name is Kogan. It's your boy Kane. And that's Skull Pack React.